Hey everyone, it's Tom Crowds with another Rockstar Minute. And look, there's two money systems in Canada. When I was younger, I really only thought there was one money system and I walked around thinking that way for a long time. And that money system was you get a job and in exchange for something that you're doing, you get money or you kind of sell stuff, you start a business and you sell some stuff in exchange for stuff you're selling, you get money and kind of like that's how you made money. Like that's a normal money system. That's how I was trained to think about money. But it wasn't for many years until I realized there are actually two money systems in Canada. And the second money system is that there is the creation of money and governments and banks, so in Canada, banks magically create money out of thin air and then they are allowed to profit from that by lending it out into the world. It's not like the CIBC or the Royal Bank save up all this money. Like, it's not like they have like $5 million that they've saved up and they now say, okay, we are gonna lend this money out into the world and we will reap the rewards of the interest on that money and that's how we will profit. When you and I borrow to buy a property, for example, and that mortgage is created, that money is magically created out of thin air and the 500 thousand dollars that you need to go buy that property is created of thin air and magically comes into the economy and then you can do with it as you wish and that's the second money system and the closer that you are to that second money system the more you can profit from it so the banks are obviously obviously really close they great get to create the money but if you can do things like buy good income properties you can access that second money system and I had no idea about that second money system and the governments always screw up the second money system so interest rates either go too high or too long and they've definitely screwed it up for the last 10 years and that's why property prices have gone up way too high and that's why the destruction of the middle class is going on and that's why no one can afford properties in this area and I think they're gonna screw it up for the next 10 years but it doesn't matter to me as long as I understand the second money system I can like selfishly position my Myself to profit from it. So it's worth your study, I think, it's worth my study, I think, to understand that there's two money systems. Understand like, you know, careers and starting your own business and that whole world, but understand this magical money system of creating money out of thin air because it exists and there's a lot of ways to profit from it if you understand it. So hopefully that gives you something to think about. I didn't understand it for a very long time. Hopefully that gives you something to think about. Until next time, your life, your terms.